Surgically assisted is when the surgeon actually opens up the palate surgically. Um, I've been there to watch it. They do it with a chisel and crack it. And again, I've had some patients do this. And when you start turning it, it's shocking because you know you can get so you can put three or four quarters between their front teeth pretty quickly. So it allows for that movement to get that expansion, get the, the skeletal components over one another properly, and then you can start moving the teeth into the right position. Today, what's really cool is the ability to use these palatal screws. And this looks, a, this is a little bit inaccurate, inaccurate today because now what they, a lot of times what they do with the mini screws is they put the screws in and they have the, the palatal expander but they don't touch the teeth at all. Mariana Evans, who's an orthodontist in Philadelphia, has many cases where she's able to crack the suture on an adult without surgery by just putting in these temporary implants and start turning them. And on certain patients, it will crack and open up. And so, you know, it's not a 100%, but you know, it's worth a shot, a shot, particularly if you're not looking at a great big burly person. Three piece or two piece maxillary surgery. And we talked about the SARPI. And a lot of times this is a, a situation where they're, they're correcting both AP as well as um, transverse relationships, often maybe um, a, a part of a mandibular advancement or something they're doing to the mandible. 